Hello, I'm Cheese Puff 14, interviewing live uh, with Spinosaurus 12 from the BNC uh, Social Housing Advising Board. It's glad to be on the show. So, I'd like to start off with what is the current state of social housing in this area? I believe that cur the current state of social housing is poor, as the government provides more social housing the bad, the worse quality it becomes. Over 2.2 million people in the UK rent from the local authorities. However, 9.0 million of people in the UK rent from other social landlords, mainly housing associations. Social housing can even be renovated buildings. An office was renovated to accommodate people who had applied for social housing. They each got one room to live in. Can you imagine? One room? No. Anyway, there weren't any safety precautions on, on the place and no safety checks had been done on the office. You turn a tap and you electrocute yourself. A baby died because the ambulance couldn't find the office as it didn't have a proper dress. I'd say the stage of cr social housing is at a critical time. Yeah. So what are your thoughts on the incident of Grenfell Tower? Well, I think that Grenfell Tower has changed people's opinions on social housing and has opened their eyes to the bad quality the government were providing. Grenfell Tower happened because of the cheap, flammable cladding the government used. So the government could have checked the cladding to see if it was flammable. The safety precautions weren't working, so, so the fire spread quickly. The government could have done regular safety checks to make sure they were working. Summing it all up, I would say the government could have prevented Grenfell Tower fire by doing the necessary things as safety checks and testing the materials they were using. Okay, thank you. So, what are the possible solutions for this crisis? Some possible solutions to the government could have a record, they could have a record on the landlords owning the buildings, or they could do regular visits to see the standard people are living in, or if their safety systems are in fully functioning order. Yes, so could you expand on why you think these are the best solutions? Though? I think these are the best solutions, as they use not much of the government's money or time, but fix a big section of the government's problem. So, what issues do you think you may face with these solutions? Some, some issues may be sloppiness and not remembering regular visits to check the safety precautions. Also, there may be deceitfulness with the records about the buildings. So, how will you overcome them? One thing, one of the things which will help overcome them is making timetables to show when visits are happening so no one forgets and also to make sure everything goes, that goes on the record is checked thoroughly. How, have the, how, how has the media affected people's po opinions on social housing? As I said before, Grenville Towers fire opened people's eyes but the media strengthened people's opinions against social housing and, and they showed the consequences that can happen when you don't spend much time on it. How should the government act on the solutions? I think they should start off with smaller buildings and grow bigger and grow out to bigger buildings. For example, Grenfell Tower. I would say if they start in January 2018, the problem of social housing could be solved quicker. This would mean their focus would be on the negotiations of Brexit and school cuts, not on social, social housing. It would also mean less money would be going to the cause of social housing if they sought out with these solutions. With everything that's been going on in Parliament, where do you think the social housing issue is in the government's mind currently? Our out of 10, I would say it's a 5, as it isn't what the government is really focusing on, as, it, as they're focusing on the, 
the negotiations of Brexit, which are taking a turn for the worst. However, as the government focuses, focus relates to social housing, for example, Grenfell Towers fire, I believe it will positively spiral to the government's attention. Thank you very much. That's My her thoughts. thoughts.